Hello, Andy from Mind Apples here. Smart businesses promote well-being. Let me give you a few reasons why. Number one, decision making. Are people in your organization making the best decisions that they can? If they're under stress, probably the answer is no. Stress changes the way that we process risks and makes it harder to analyze information. So staff under stress will often make mistakes and do things that they would never consider to be reasonable in calm and normal environments. So think about how to reduce stress levels, partly to look after staff, but also to make sure that you assess risk well and have good governance. Number two, talent. Good people are hard to find, so when we find them, let's look after them. But people who really care about their work, who aspire to be the best at what they do, are often more likely to become stressed or to burn out. And so we need to take good care of them, encourage people to take breaks, and ensure that the working environment allows people to work in a sustainable and healthy way, so that we hang on to the good people that we have and we help them to do their best work. Number three, productivity. Businesses that don't invest in the minds of their staff often lose productivity because good productivity involves us being able to concentrate, to pay attention well, to apply our minds to what we're doing. And the time that we lose in productivity, the least productive points in our days, tends not to be when we're resting. That's useful, it allows us to get our energy back. But it's the time when we are feeling like we aren't getting much done but we feel guilty and we keep pressing ahead anyway. So encouraging staff to listen to their minds, to take steps, to look after their well-being and maintain their mental energy levels can help them to be more effective at what they're doing. And of course, let's not forget the ethical dimension. We don't want people to feel endangered at work, cause people harm. We want people to be well. We want our workplaces to be positive places. So let's work together to combine these different agendas because actually looking after people is good for business. The performance of any organization depends on the performance of the minds of the people in it. So let's all create the conditions for minds to thrive. And what we do at Mind Apples is tell you how to do that. We can equip your managers with tools to manage people in a safe and sustainable way. We can empower individuals to look after their own well-being and articulate what they need to you. And we can help organizations to put staff well-being, mental health and performance at the center of their strategies to give them a competitive edge.